this is a, a neat night uh, for a lot of reasons, but all these people have so many years of history. I have. You're good, Jeffrey. You're good. You got a gift. <laughs> but uh, I told I've told these guys this story for for a long, long time. But it's a, it's important to me. Um, what an inspiration they were to me as a young kid. I. Um, <laughs> I was in, I think I was a freshman in high school, and Mr. Bojangles had come out, it was this huge hit, and, and I played the banjo a little bit, not very good, but I was learning to play, and, and there was a, a rock band in, in, uh, in our area of, of Oklahoma City that was the hottest rock band going, and they were the coolest things ever, and I was kind of a dork because I played the banjo, and... and It's not about you yet. <laughs> anyway, they were going to do Mr. Bojangles in their show at the school. They were going to play a big concert at school. And they asked me if I would come and play the banjo on Mr. Bojangles with them. And it was actually one of the coolest things that ever happened to me because I was accepted. And it mattered. And all that to say, because these guys recorded that great Jerry Jeff song, I got to play it, and it helped me in my life. <laughs> and, and I've been friends with them for 41 years, 42 years. We played a concert together back in the early 70s, and, and it was so much fun. And, and it was a friendship, like I said, that lasted all these years. And uh, I was rummaging around my mom's house not long ago, and I'd always told Jeff this story of, of getting to play Bojangles in, in, in those early years of high school. And I found the picture of me playing the banjo with that band, and I gave it to Jeff not long ago as a present. <laughs> Pretty cool. I'm going to do a, a song that they did on the Circle Record back in 1972 that honored the great Doc Watson, one of the greatest guitar players that ever did.
Tennessee stuff. 